Los Angeles, Russell Westbrook hit a key fourth quarter jump shot to push the Los Angeles Lakers lead from 4 to 6 in an eventual 108 to 103 win over the Minnesota Timberwolves on Sunday night. He also had 9 turnovers and shot 0 for 5 from 3, which helped allow the Wolves, missing two of their stars in Carl Anthony Towns and D'Angelo Russell because of the league's health and safety protocols, to hang around so late into the game to begin with. When asked what the jump shot did for him, contributing in a big moment after not playing his best up to that point, Westbrook took umbrage with the question. I disagree, Westbrook said. I disagree with the part that the game wasn't going my way. Westbrook finished with 20 points on 7 for 16 shooting overall, hit 6 of 8 free throws and also added 5 assists, 3 rebounds and a steal, which he implied were just as important as the misses or the miscues. My game, you know, is fine, H. My game is not predicated on shots or if I turn the ball over. Like, I miss some shots, that's part of the game. I'm allowed to miss shots. I can do that. Like any other player, I can do that. I can turn the ball over, too. I can do that. That's all a part of the game. Westbrook, the only player in league history to average a triple-double in four different seasons in his career, went on to explain that statistics don't tell the story of what he brings to the table to help his team win. When you watch a basketball game and figure out, as for the jumper he hit, a pull-up shot from 19 feet up that went in even though Minnesota's Anthony Edwards fouled him on the release and put L. A. Up 99-93 with 4 minutes, 56 seconds remaining, Westbrook shrugged off any added significance to the score. And that shot, I mean, just a shot I work. It didn't really do nothing for me, just that it's been there all night and I should have been taking it. While Westbrook wouldn't accept the characterization that he struggled on Sunday, it was obvious to other members of his team. Had a tough night tonight, said Lakers coach Frank Vogel. But has improving and we're evolving offensively. So, the guys are in different spots, and some of that is the pieces moving around and that and it's not just him. Indeed, the Lakers went with a centerless lineup, as they have recently, with LeBron James manning the middle. Despite being out-rebounded 56-28 by the Wolves, Vogel never brought in either of his traditional bigs, Dwight Howard and DeAndre Jordan, off the bench, 